Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Look MRI, and this is a 50-year-old male with a recent injury, lots of pain and swelling in the foot, and we see he has some serious problems in multiple places. One of them is here, this is the big toe, great toe here. This is the first metatarsal bone. If we follow the metatarsal bone back, we see a line right here. It's a little hard to see on this, but the patient has a fracture here. They also have a fracture here of the fourth metatarsal base. This is the fifth. This is the fifth toe, the pinky toe, the fifth metatarsal, here's the base. If we scoot one over to the fourth, we see there's a piece of bone, a fragment, pulled off here. So there's a displaced fracture of the fourth metatarsal base. And if we look at these other ones here, we see that there's a little shift. This is the second metatarsal, and it does not line up with this second cuneiform bone. Marrow edema, marrow edema. So you can see a little step off along this medial margin. So we know this patient has had a midfoot dislocation. It's not straight, it's slipped laterally. So it's really more of a subluxation, it sublux laterally, but we call it a midfoot dislocation. And when they have a midfoot dislocation like that, we look for a ligament called the Lisfranc ligament to see if it's torn. And the Lisfranc ligament holds this second metatarsal base in place. It attaches over here to this medial cuneiform bone or the first cuneiform bone. And there should be a little horizontal dark band here connecting this bone to this bone. And again, it keeps the second metatarsal base um, in position. It does not allow it to drift outwards or laterally. And so this patient has a ruptured Lisfranc ligament. So on this view, we see white right here. Instead of seeing white there, we should see a nice little dark ligament. This is the ligament right there, that little gray thing where the hand is on. That is a piece of that Lisfranc ligament. Again, it should come right across over here, but instead it is ruptured and the second metatarsal base is drifted out here laterally. So we call this a Lisfranc ligament rupture with a midfoot uh, dislocation and also associated with fractures. So it's a Lisfranc type fracture dislocation. Sometimes they just have bone bruises. Um, and this patient has a fracture here of the third cuneiform bone, a fracture of the fourth metatarsal base, fracture of the first metatarsal base. So lots of injuries here in this poor patient and again that associated tear the Lisfranc ligament.